On Friday, September 10th, the Lake Orion DDA hosted its first ever Oktoberfest event in the village and the turnout was tremendous. Visitors enjoyed a beer tent, food, live music and games for the whole family. There was also a costume contest and an award was handed out to the best yodeler. Describe what's happening here today. Describe the environment and activities that have taken place. Well, definitely we have a beer tent going on, but we also have um, an eight-person live band. Um, they're doing a combination between pop hits uh, and Oktoberfest German uh, traditional stuff. We've got uh, flick and chicken games, and um, we've we had a wiener race. This uh, dogs uh, this earlier today. We've had yodeling contests. We we did our very very best to make this a family friendly event that was also um, true to the tradition of Oktoberfest. Not only did the DDA benefit from the event, but they invited other nonprofits to join in on the fun. The Lake Orion Lions Club helped set up Oktoberfest and organized a 50/50 raffle. Representatives of the American Legion worked the beer tent and were allowed to keep the tips they collected. Do you want to give any credit to any of those who were responsible for organizing this and pulling this all together? Uh, we have a brand new event coordinator. Her name is Susie Sebastian. This is her baby. This was her big show and we're very proud of her. I'm very proud of her and I'm, I'm proud of my team. Um, we've got a, an army of volunteers that have been here. Um, our administrative coordinator, Justice, has been um, just a trooper through every uh, everything we've been doing. Our board members have been here. Yeah, lots of people were needed to get this effort done, and lots of people came and showed up and did their job. <laughs> Based on the success of the event, we're told the DDA board will consider the possibility of making Oktoberfest an annual event. Next up on the calendar, Broadway Street in the village will be closed to traffic on Wednesday, October 20th for the family-friendly Halloween extravaganza. For more information, visit downtownlakeorion.org. In Lake Orion, this is Joe Johnson reporting for ONTV News.